morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you guys are in the world. I hope you guys are having a good day. Welcome back. If you are new to the channel, my name is David Sriracha. So, did you guys like my Chick-fil-A video? If you guys haven't checked that out yet, the link is right here. And yes, please do check it out because you know what? I'm still paying for it. Can't go into detail, but just know I'm still paying for it. Yeah. Anyway, so um, we are on our way back from Destin, Florida. Uh, it's about a 9 to 10 hour drive, depending on the traffic. You know, it was just the uh, two of us, me and my wife. Then we could just drive straight, but since we have two young kids with us, we had to make a stop. And we decided to make a stop at Ben Rouge. Uh, we heard a lot of good things about the city, so you know, I want to stop by and you know, maybe uh, check out some places to eat and stuff like that. So we decided to stay at the Hilton Double Tree in Baton Rouge. And uh, if I tell you guys the reason, please don't laugh, okay? You guys are ready? Well, the reason is that they have the best walnut and chocolate chip cookies. Yep. At any time during your stay, you can just go to the counter and be like, May I please have some cookies? And they'll be like, How many would you like? And you know, me being greedy, I'd be like, Can I please have four? And you know, they keep them behind the counter, warm, ready to go. So when you eat them, it's like a taste of heaven. If you guys do stay at the Hilton, you'll see what I'm talking about. You know, we had a chance to experience this in um, the Hilton Double Tree in Puerto Rico. And so we want our daughter to experience it. So yeah, that's the reason why we came here. The room cost us $192.47. But you know, it was on a Saturday night, so that was expected. Anyways, I want to take this opportunity to give you guys a room tour of the room. So just in case if one day, if you guys decided to come to Baton Rouge, you guys have an idea where to stay at and stuff like that. Also, on another note, this will be the last boring room tour videos. Uh, from now on, the new um, you know hotel room tour, it will look something like this. So I hope you guys didn't get dizzy from watching that. But anyways, without further ado, let the reviews begin. We got here later than we expected because we decided to pick out at the Silver Slipper Casino. Check-in was really fast and easy. They got us on the fifth floor. Traveling with two kids is not a joke. Ooh wee! When you get to the room, you are welcome with two bottles of water. I really like the setup. You have a mini fridge and a microwave. That to me is really important if you travel with kids. Over here you have the bathroom area. If you do forget one of the following items, they have it available for you at the front desk for free. The water pressure was nice. The bathtub slash shower area was huge. It has an extended area for your shampoo, conditioner, and towel. Right outside we have this lounge area. Really comfortable chair. And over here we have a couch which can be converted into a sofa bed. And I guess this is where I will be sleeping for tonight. They have all kinds of wall decoration which make the room feel like home. You also have a TV in the lounge area. What I love about this room is the high ceiling. It make the room feel bigger. You also have a little office area and in here we have the king side bed. Let's give it a test. You also have another TV, huge closet with iron, iron bore, and a safe. We had to leave first thing in the morning so I didn't get a chance to explore the hotel to see what else they have to offer. I waited all day for this cookie. You know the best thing about them is like if you want one you can just go ask the, the fun desk and they'll give it to you. All you can eat. Chocolate walnut cookie. Oh. Mm. So I hope you guys enjoyed that room tour here at the Double Tree by Hilton in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Thank you so much if you stay to the end. Be sure to hit the subscribe button on your way out and I'll see you soon. So the next morning as I was moving the luggage to the car, I overheard a conversation between a housekeeper and a co-worker. 
she was like, girl, you know I didn't get any tea at all yesterday. So, assuming T stands for tip, I decided to write her a note. And don't worry, it's not a bad one.